him. New tonight, we're also following a surprise at the Savannah Chatham School Board President's Debate. All five of the candidates taking part for the very first time. WTOC's Don Lagata has been following this debate all day as it formed up, basically heard from people what might take place. Don, you hinted on the news at six that candidate Dave Simons might show up. Right. He turned down the invite originally, but when I spoke to him around 4.30 this afternoon, he told me exclusively he just might make an appearance. We also mentioned the people behind the taunts calling him a chicken for not showing up to previous debates may strike again. And guess what? The chicken and Dave Simons, they were both there. Is this a surprise for everybody? It is. No one involved with the debate was expecting David Simons to join his fellow candidates, but he did. Let, let's get ready to rumble. And while the candidates were inside tackling the issues of a school board president. Can you tell me who you guys are with? Outside, two young men, one in a chicken suit, posted signs and put flyers on cars, specifically targeting Simons, referring to him once again as Chicken Dave. Cluck, 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 cluck. You can't tell me who, uh, who's... Uh, not at the moment. Who's behind these signs and the chicken outfit? No, sir, not at the moment. The questions on the signs came into play as well as other specific questions to Simons during the audience question period. You said the school board is a business. How much money have you made doing government consulting for construction companies that do businesses with the board? Quite frankly, I find that to be an inappropriate and an offensive question. Uh, you should know better. Quite frankly, I'm a businessman. I make money. I'm not apologetic for it. I'm okay with it. It's, it's pure chicken garbage put out by some of the other campaigns. Nobody takes pot shots at the guy running in last place. Questions don't bother me. The, uh, the voters decide who they want to speak to and what questions they want to ask, and so that's what happened. I thought that was the wrong thing to do because it's not about Dave Simons one way or the other. It's about what's best for the children of Chatham County. So I, I think we should have left that alone. I know there was going to be some candidates that might be in a little more focus on, but I'm not here to worry about their focus. I'm here to run for this seat, to be a voice for our children. My goal for running for school board president is to bring the community to the table, to open the voice for, for our uh, students, for our teachers, and for our families. Simon says the attacks take the focus off the issues, but with two debates left, we may not have seen the last of the chicken. I'm amused, you know, I think it's uh, pretty funny because as somebody that has served their country in a war zone several times, somebody that's served in the Green Berets, I can pretty much guarantee you I'm no chicken. Interestingly enough, the chicken in the parking lot hightailed it before the debate even finished. So who's the real chicken, some might ask? I guess the answer is the question right there. The next debate, all five candidates will be at next Wednesday night at the Jewish Educational Alliance. Sonny. Thanks very much, Don.